Let's talk about something super important, which is learning how to sit and be by yourself. This is something I tell every single one of my clients to do at some point, and that is to go into a room, lights off, set your phone to for a timer for 60 minutes, and put it outside the bedroom, and literally sit there and meditate. The purpose of meditation, a lot of people think, is just to clear your mind and not have any thoughts and just totally zen out, but that's not realistic, is it? The reason why I do this is because when you're able to sit down in a room with all of your thoughts, your demons, your insecurities, your fears, and all this other bullshit that you've been thinking about for years, you tend to face that stuff head on. And when you face that stuff head on, you absolutely disarm it. You dismantle it. The shit goes away. So those fears, those demons, those insecurities, those regrets, that trauma, the worst version of yourself you've ever been, all that stuff goes away, right? It just dissipates because you're finally able to sit down with it, stare it in the face and completely disempower it. And the reason why I tell clients to do this sometimes multiple times is because it takes a few times to try it out, to nail it down. And instead of doing what most people do, which is they kind of space this pain out and they resist it and they run away from it for years and years and years. What this does is it causes an energetic weight, W E I G H T to your life. And when you have energetic weight onto your life because of fears and trauma and regrets and certain things that have transpired in your life, you end up with energetic weight, which is W A I T. And that's why you can't manifest. And that's why your life is not where it should be. And that's why you're still at whatever age, continuing to learn the same lessons that you should have learned when you were younger, or you should have learned the first time is because you haven't been able to face the things that you've done wrong. You haven't been able to face the worst parts of yourself. And that's why sitting in a room with an hour uh, for an hour by yourself is so difficult is because shit hurts. It's painful and it's meant to be, it's supposed to be. And I encourage my clients to do this usually within the first couple of sessions, but I'm telling you, if you can do this today, this week, you will profoundly come out of, of your life and this experience, a much better person, a stronger version of yourself guaranteed. So do this, go sit in a room for an hour, come out of it with your new thoughts, with whatever's transpired. And not only will you have more mental clarity, you'll have more space, you'll have more energy and you'll have more awareness about who the fuck you are and where the fuck you're supposed to go with your life. Okay. Try it out. Let me know what you guys think. Hopefully this makes sense, but I encourage every single one of my clients to do it and, so should you. See you guys in the next one.